for the coffee mug right click uh, actually this time we won't do the cylinder like this we'll do um, we'll stain model and we'll go make sure we have a new layer or if not we press N that it's active we'll look down get the cylinder I'm gonna only ask for one segment and usually I don't want too many sides 8 or 12 but because we are doing a coffee mug and we need a room to do the handle I'll go 32 hold control to get a perfect circle Q to drop and shift it to uh, frame and this is good enough so R to scale it a little bit so it's more like a coffee mug freeze scale if you do R in polygon you don't need to do this um, and then uh, 3 for polygon R scale it a little bit then from the top uh, right away I'm going to move it this a little bit down B shift click wow if you want this to uh, stay sharp you can just go B Q and this to stay sharp you could uh, go with the edge add loop here we can use both sides like that and we can shift click to do the same thing inside voila Q and uh, looks like I scale it the wrong way I should be okay and we can do the same inside B B again for bevel to be in object mode tab and you see it's clean we can add maybe one more here but we will in a few seconds so now I need to add edge where I'll do the um, the, the handle so you have to think ahead so for sure I'll need maybe one here uh, another one here I'm holding shift and in the middle I think we can go back without both sides and one is enough and you don't have to be precise but you could type 50% if you really want Q now we're gonna go in edge select those two for the handle make sure we are in local action center local so when I go R it's looking at each center instead of the entire cup do this Q uh, 3 for polygon, select those two B, bevel move it up a hair, scale them quite a bit Q, now only select those two and rotate it B you could move it down a hair but that should be enough actually here it might help a little bit but on the bottom I don't think so Okay, select both, uh, remove local, so none, and now we'll do a bridge. Segment to one, click anywhere to apply the bridge, and now we can grow the segment. So maybe three, go Q, and we're basically done. If you go tab, we already have it but let me show you a few things um, you could come here double click you could scale this to make it a uh, hair smaller you could do the same here actually I'm pressing uh, R and just for design um, you could also select those two shift up to grow and I don't want the inside but I could use this so I'm holding shift to add and if we want we can have this uh, hair sharper so uh, B Q so now if you go in tab you see it's much sharper looks a bit better if you want to do a render uh, M first of all to give it its own material so cup and then F8 for the preview you might
I want to do a floor so it has it can cast a shadow right click primitive plane like this and then uh, as long as you have the asset downloaded um, you could start to drag and drop so we can go F6 and you can go under asset here or you can go under the um, cloud the only thing with the cloud you have to download them so if I went organic and it's a bit slow so if let's say I wanted this one uh, maybe a better one something funny uh, this you have to right click and go load and it would go exactly on the local uh, material organic in the local one the exact same folder material organic and you see it should be there I don't know why miscellaneous there we go so this has displacement so I don't think for my laptop it's good uh, I think I put a ceramic one uh, but I think it was at work so I don't think on my laptop I downloaded it but just to show you you could just drag and drop uh, this you will need lighting to uh, for this one to look good like maybe an environment so I could go here and uh, pick also an environment we can pick the one we always use in SolidWorks we might have to rotate that one and that's it and once again we can go shading um, uh, environment environment we can say hide it uh, tune it down 0.6 and the list goes on and if you move the mouse it'll render exactly where you are voila